It has been an eventful 24 hours for the Mitiana Municipality Member of Parliament, Francis Zake. He was arrested in Kampala on Thursday evening and spent some time at the same this morning he was taken to Alua, where he was charged before the magistrate court for unlawful escape from police custody. The MP entered a plea of not guilty. He entered a plea of not guilty and was granted a non-cash bail of 50 million shillings. Zaki's freedom was short-lived as he was arrested and transported to Guru where he was charged for treason before the magistrate's court. It is alleged that you are unlawfully with others aimed and threw stones, thereby hitting and smashing the rear wing. For the moment, you will be remanded to Guru prison until 14th of March. The thing for which I have praised and given respect to police before is that this time around they were professional. They just indi indicated that he was under arrest and he submitted. The charges stem from events during the campaigns for the by election for Alu municipality parliamentary seat where more than 30 people were arrested on charges of obstruction and malicious damage to property. But remember the main case that we are in is a case of public interest is that one of treason where there was an attack on the convoy of His Excellency the President. Now it is upon that that uh, of course he's been rearrested, it's, uh, it's allowed and conveyed now to Guru where he's going to appear. This is not a new thing they are doing. We are sure we will defeat them. We will go to court, find them and defeat them from there. So I am happy that uh, they are resorting to court. They have not resorted to the usual criminality of the state. The police spokesperson, Freddy Nanga, condemned politicians who disrespect police summons and orders. Who is disgraceful to the laws of this country, and yet uh, the, there is integrity of, uh, under the criminal... We want to protect the integrity of the criminal justice system. These laws have to be respected. I know for a fact that we respect the police. It's the constitutional uh, institution. It uh, plays a big role. Zaki and his co-accused, who include MPs Kassian Wadiri, Robert Chiagulanyi and Gerard Kalwanga, will turn to Guru Magistrates Court on 14th March. Ivan Shimuchigozi, NTV.